help when it's needed most. Sickle cell disease can be so painful, patients can't do even simple daily tasks, let alone work. That makes it easy to fall behind on bills and into bankruptcy. But one woman just started a new way to help relieve some financial stress. Kevin Barry explains in this News 5 original. So people with sickle cell, when they're sick, they can't work. Most of them are on disability, and they're always a little gap, and they need some money from time to time. That's why Teresa McCurry created the MCS Fund, named after her daughter, Misha Saxton. Misha died because of her sickle cell disease at 14 months old, inspiring Teresa to help other patients. While other nonprofits help pay for patient care or research, they aren't allowed to help cover other expenses. Our sole existence is to collect unrestricted funds to be able to be a blessing to people affected with sickle cell. Patients can apply to get up to $150 through the MCS fund. That money can go towards groceries, utility bills, or credit card bills, which is what Glinda Dames Fincher used it for. Any type of stress, as a matter of fact, physical and emotional stress, can kick off a sickle cell crisis. Galinda is one of the people the fund has helped so far, trying to prevent their stress so they can treat their disease. In Cleveland, I'm Kevin Barry, News 5. Patients can apply through their social worker or another nonprofit. This summer, the MCS Fund plans on having a big event on World Sickle Cell Day. You can learn more about that event and the MCS Fund under this story on the News 5 app.